Rise and shine, beauties! Welcome to this week's episode featuring my morning routine. You guys will be seeing my makeup, hair, skincare regime. And yes, we are waking up quite early today. We got a workout to do. We got to get ready for the day. So excuse how dead I look in this shot, but I'm showing you the real, raw Kristen, okay? You know, that's how we do on this channel. So, Make sure you continue watching, hit that subscribe button, and let's get it! So for my workout junkies out there, you guys have to get the Sweet Sweat Enhancer. Also the Sweet Sweat Belt, it comes in many different colors, but what you do is you just place it in those trouble areas where you want to lose inches, and wear it while you work out, and I swear, it really does work and help target and burn fat more in those areas. As always, everything will be linked down below in this video. Most of it is from Amazon. And now let's get into this workout. So lately, I have been just getting back onto my health grind, eating healthy, working out in the mornings. I'm already down three pounds. You guys, I always fluctuate with my weight. It's one of those things that tends to suffer when I get really busy. So I've just really tried to make it a priority again. And it's a journey, guys. Don't get hard on yourselves. If you fall off, just get right back to it. I know what to do. It's just about staying consistent. And I love following these Pop Sugar Fitness videos. They're 30 minutes long for all levels with or without equipment. It's great. And I feel like I get a great sweat from following these instructors. And you guys will see right here the sweet sweat at work and all that yucky sweat sweat coming out yeah now it's time to get nice and clean we're gonna shower up and one thing i wanted to show you was this new shower head that i got from amazon it's a filtered shower head it removes any nasty stuff in the water hey guys i'm kristen oh look at me trying to be all cute <laughs> let's do the skincare routines i'm gonna be bumping the new chris brown album in the background so don't mind my embarrassing dance moves in this video <laughs> uh, but let's start with this first cleanse the one and only cleanse in this routine is the vital c image hydrating facial cleanser it's creamy, it's hydrating, it smells amazing, it's scented with natural orange peel essential oils. It's got vitamin A, C, and E in there. I've talked to you guys about this on my channel before. You guys have seen it in my nighttime skincare routine. I try to not have like 10,000 different products, so you guys will see some re repeat products in this video. Don't turn on me yet because... There is a few other things that I didn't show you in the nighttime skincare routine that I want you to see in this video. So, keep on watching. Next is the Tripeptide Eye Cream from SkinScript. This helps lessen the appearance of wrinkles and prevents water loss from the delicate eye tissue. This product in particular was the ASCP Skin Deep winner of 2022. So it is a well-known product in the industry it's got some really good hydrators in there like squalene jojoba oil and sunflower seed oil and don't even get me started on the vital c hydrating anti-aging serum from image it is my hands down favorite vitamin c serum i don't care what any of you guys say I will talk about this serum in every darn video if I need to because it is my go-to. I've been using it for years and years and years and years and years and I've not been able to find anything better. So come at me. Next is the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Acid Moisturizer. It is a whopping 30% <laughs> hyaluronic acid complex and it just melts into the skin like butter, okay? I put it all over my chest, my arms, my face everywhere and i definitely don't feel like it clogs the pores it is great for dry to normal to oily to acneic skin types and now you know i love me a facial toning treatment and either nighttime or morning routine so i switched between using my new face device and my facial roller so i did the new face yesterday i'm going to be doing 
the facial roller today and it's just good to promote lymphatic drainage reduce puffiness penetrate those products deeper into the skin and i know i feel a huge difference after i use it you can just see your, my face just instantly gets slimmer from using this and of course you know you could add a little dancing and singing into this part too so i'm gonna let you guys in on my little secret i have not been using foundation for a bit now i've been combining the image tinted moisturizer with spf and the mattifying moisturizer with the spf and you guys these two go together like peanut butter and jelly it's amazing my skin's been loving it just that light sheer coverage and it's my go-to now. And now the cucumber hydration toner from SkinScript is gonna be the bread for our peanut butter and jelly. And it's just gonna bring it all together and make it nice and hydrated for this next step we're about to get into. You guys, when I find a product that I love, I stick with it for a very long time. And I have been using this Magic Eraser Concealer from Maybelline for a long time. It's phenomenal it has great coverage it's not cakey it blends really well i use the shade in medium and i just cover up the trouble areas the under eyes the lip the nose area and any maybe blemishes that i might have that day and that is really to the extent of what kind of coverage i use on my skin these days um, so get yours in your shade get it on amazon or from target now we're gonna take a powder puff and the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder, and we are gonna set that concealer along with the whole entire face. Now don't cake this on, you guys. We are using a very light layer of this. I find that when I put a layer of powder over the tinted moisturizer and the concealer, it allows me to perfectly place a bronzer and the next products we'll be using on my skin. Open out the Fenty Matte Bronzer in Private Island. There's a ton of different shades. Riri's really good at being inclusive for all skin shades and colors, which I love. And the formula is just amazing. Goes on perfectly, can build the coverage. It's just awesome. So here, I've been really trying to place the bronzer right into that cheekbone not really bringing it toward the mouth as far as i used to and i find that it really lifts that cheekbone and makes it pop more of course we gotta snatch the jawline because you know we don't all have perfect jaws like angelina jolie okay we gotta create the illusion and same with the nose um, I put it right on the bridge and the tip of the nose, melting into that eyelid brow area. That is what I've seen a lot of the celebrity makeup artists doing. So I do that so I feel like a celebrity, okay? Um, you guys, this routine is not going to be full glam. I'm showing you something that I can do in like 20 to 30 minutes in the morning. We're filming this on a Saturday, but this is something I would do during the week when I'm going to go to work just to create that contour and depth into my eyes. Um, and it really just gets as simple as that. Now we're applying some MAC blush onto the cheeks. Nothing crazy, just to bring some color back to the skin. And then we're going back with the powder puff and the Laura Mercier powder. And we're gonna be cutting um, those contour lines in the cheeks and on the nose area. And I find that this helps to just refine the look and make it softer and not as harsh and here's a little trick for you take the remaining powder on that puff and just lightly tap onto the blush and the bronzed areas and it will just create like almost a filter on your face it's going to soften that up it's not going to be as harsh of lines on your face and then i reapply where i want it to be more defined now I'll be using the Brow Freeze by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Definitely been a favorite of mine. The container is almost empty. I'm going to have to re-up soon. And I like to apply this with a Q-tip just so that I can get an exact precise application. And I just apply evenly across the brows. And it doesn't need to be perfect at this step because I'm going to be using a um, brow brush to help to get the hairs into the direction that I want them to go.
And then just to fill in the gaps, I use a Brow Duo Powder from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I use a brow brush in more hair-like directions to make it look more natural. Now the icing on the cake is this Hyper Real Glow palette from MAC. It's a highlighter palette and I love to use those last two colors there and combine them. And I'll tap it onto my eyelids. Later on after I dust off the translucent powder, I'll put it on my upper cheekbones, my tip of my nose, my lip, and my chin just to kind of bring out those areas more and just wrap up this makeup look. Now we gotta do something about this hair and we are going to be crimping it, but first we're gonna apply some Moroccan oil to help hydrate and also act as a heat protectant. So I'm gonna go ahead and work that into the ends of the hair, not really focusing it too much on the scalp area because I don't want it to get too oily. And uh, while I wait for the crimper to heat up, I'm going to put a lip mask on, the Laneige sleeping mask, which, guys, it doesn't just need to be used for sleeping, okay? You can use it <laughs> anytime you need to just give your lips a nice bit of hydration and suppleness. The insert name here, hair crimper, waver, whatever you want to call it, has been an amazing addition to my hair tool collection. I use it very frequently, and it gives the perfect waves to the hair and it's i don't know i like that kind of messy curly look um sometimes i don't want to use a curling iron that makes it look more refined this is a more casual fun type of hairstyle i like to do and i won't bore y'all with this whole process i will be back in just two seconds right here and whoop bam here it is the finished look and of course, we gotta tame those hairs a little. So we're gonna use some texturizing spray. I don't know how to pronounce that. Joico, I, guys, how do I pronounce that? <laughs> I, I struggled with that in the last video I talked about this product in, but here it is in action. I'm using it to kind of just tame the front and also some of the flyaways on top. And after I do these dance moves, I'm actually gonna be working some more Moroccan oil into the ends of my hair to sort of rehydrate it from the heat. And that about does it for this quick 20, 30 minute esthetician, morning routine slash skincare routine, hair routine, makeup routine-ish, whatever you wanna call it. Um, continue watching guys, I'm gonna show you what I do to get myself in the right mindset for the day. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, and comment below maybe what your favorite part of the routine was and maybe a product you're hoping to um, try out yourself. Hey y'all, thanks for continuing to watch. Regardless of it being a weekday or a weekend, um, this part of my day is like an absolute necessary. And I've talked to you guys about this before on my channel about work-life balance. And one of the things that I find really helps me get back to my like happy place is to meditate in the mornings daily. What I do is I get my phone here and I'm gonna be turning on my TV and I put on a really calming relaxing you know youtube video and then i set my timer for um, 10 minutes and within that first five minutes i am saying my affirmations saying what i'm thankful for out loud and i'm laying there and just honestly picturing like my happy place you know for me it's the ocean or laying in a pool and just floating there um something that's like mindless in a sense and i'm just counting my breaths as uh, i'm laying there and i'm waiting for that timer to go off um if you might catch yourself drifting into thoughts and thinking about oh my gosh i gotta do this today i gotta do that today well that's not the time for this this is the time to really just lay there be clear your mind let yourself get back to that good place 
and it just makes your day so much better. That's what I'm about to do, and then um, I will close out this video after that. See you then. You are free, you are powerful, you are good, you are love, you have value, you have purpose, and all is well. Make sure we take our vitamins. And here's yours. Okay. I got this from Amazon, the Mary Ruth's Kids Vitamin uh, Gummies. And then I have my vitamins, which I shared with you what supplements I've been taking um, on my Amazon favorites video. So check that out. y'all well that wraps it up for this video i'm gonna dig into this omelet devin's eating his pancakes blueberries eggs which you're destroying you have a good you have a good appetite um anyways if you guys like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up comment below if you have any questions comments any suggestions for future videos i would love to hear what you might want to see next and go ahead and hit that subscribe button because you know you want to see more of this. I have great content coming for you as usual next Monday. Tune back in for another episode. And until then, we love you. Say I love you. No more? No more? Yeah, no more. Say so see you next time. Bye. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs>